What's up, decorators? We're gonna talk about the Spalder. Again, a fantastic brush, different size. You can see this is a full set. Um, so we're gonna talk about the different size because they all have different application based on the size. The way the size go from 200 to 40. Those are millimeters, the uh, metric system. Uh, we have this for water-based system and oil-based system. The only difference will be the type of hair. The, the water-based system has some nylon in it. But this is really different than, from a, than a chip brush. The chip brush is really bad quality bristle, kind of fraying, not really nice and neat, neatly packed and very fluffy and very uh, uh, soft. So it's a completely different brush. It's, this is really nice and thick, very dense, high quality bristle. So big difference uh, in terms of what you can do with it as opposed to a chip brush. Let's start with this, the number 200, a big daddy of spalter. It is held mostly, this one I use mostly when I want to tip my paint. Say you roll your base coat and you want to get rid of the uh, orange peel from the roller. This is what you're going to use to tip your paint. The other usage for it, it's for doing strie and you pull it down like this parallel to your surface. When you do the tipping, it's more perpendicular. And the next size down is the 100. The 100 is pretty much the most used size because it's the most versatile. Using my spalter, I'm going to stretch just to even out the glaze. And then I'm going to bring my glaze upward like this, from the bottom up. Uh, wood graining, we use it all the time uh, to create the moiré, those little uh, uh, ripples that hair is in wood. Take my 100 spalter. This is a wet sponge. This was dipped in the water first. Placing the spalter between my thumb and index, so it's nice and tight here. And using my fingers in the center to vary the little smile here. Hello! Hello decorators! How are you? Let's go! Is staggering my spalters tight and small living those negative shapes. Alright now size 80 and size 60 are very similar. This will allow, will allow you to get into smaller area they're fantastic to get into those little uh, casement and molding and you want to do dry brushing. It allows you to steeple in tight little areas, uh, so it's fantastic for that. And finally our size 40, uh, and this is used a lot, mostly in wood graining. Uh, allows you to do a little bit of uh, uh, figuring, uh, very good for a little stippling. You apply a little bit of paint and then you dry brush over your surface so you have those little uh, deposit of colors only on the uh, relief of your carvings and stuff like that. I highly recommend them. I'm blushing. <laughs>